three degrees, oh, two degrees in the shed. I haven't been in here for a little while. They just swept up a hell of a lot of bees. Probably another wheelbarrow full. Honestly, don't know what to think. I'm starting to lose sight of some of these colonies. I'm starting to see some of this again. A colony like this, I'm going to give them syrup and fumagillin right now. That is a very bad sign. to see it in many places not so much the nukes but I'm starting to lose sight on some of the nukes as they move up Shed's fairly easy, but they are starting to tuck themselves way up there. Look at the canola honey. I'm going to give these guys some feed just because this is not good. digging away at the corners hard 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 so hard they can't even look at that it's just they kick it out the front so they are going to get a little container of syrup lots of it oh boy woe is me I think what I might do is come through with those little containers and spot feed these messy colonies with fumagillin, give them a treatment. What do I, I have nothing to lose. This colony I've been feeding for a little while because they drop and I have no idea what's going on. Those are dead bees, they just dropped from the frames. The other colonies, they clean themselves out. The bottoms are nice and clear. Ah, spotting. But this colony and a couple other in the shed just dropped onto the bottom board. And it's not starvation, they've, I mean, they've taken syrup to the point where they quit taking syrup. They're definitely moving up. It's no wonder they're moving up with all these dead bees on the floor. I mean, it's no wonder there's any bees left in these boxes.
end of February, I tell you. Heading into March. This is when we see colony loss. March is a bitch. For the most part, I'm seeing bees in every entrance. Just not as many as I typically would have seen earlier. Way back there. Smaller little cluster now. Same with this one. Half a box of bees. Look at the canola honey. It's littered on the bottom board. Bees way back there. Once boxes of bees are shrinking, shrinking, shrinking. Oh my goodness. So, what I'm going to do is get those little feed containers, mix in some syrup with fumagillin, and I'm gonna spot feed the colonies that are showing that spottiness in the front. They're starting to blow out like that. See, they're not even taking the syrup. If it's not too late already. Making a mess. That's the only problem with feeding indoors. Wonder what? Where's those fans? The ones up there. Clunk. One, two, three, four, five frames of these. That's half a box. That is Elite Nuke. The late nuke we produced last year. It's a box of these. That is not marked. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight frames of bees and smells absolutely spectacular. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. On to nine frames of bees. Textbook. No, I better not move too far here. Get my head cut off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow, that's nice. That's probably a nuke. <sighs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. On to eight. Yeah, that's all right. Ah. Ah. Okay, I'm gonna stop doing this. Ah. Getting stung like crazy here. Nothing like putting my belly right in the front of the colony. Okay, so a few of those look pretty good. Actually, they all look pretty good. go down here. Let's watch my head. That's a box. A box OBs. One, two, three, four, five, six. On to seven. Oh, it smells so good. Uh, this one has nothing in it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. From the front half of the box. That's a box of bees. Smells so nice. So, so far I've seen lots of honey yet. Lots of bees in the top. One more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Whoa, the strips is all the way over there. bees. Boy, that smells good. Okay, that's it. 